I um, I was ever. I was. Uh, has anyone put any weight on during lockdown? This is my next question. Yeah. 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 It's a load of people looking at their dominoes app in the break. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I put weight on during lockdown, and I know I put on weight because I, uh, I went out for drinks a couple of weeks ago now with a mate of mine, and the waiter came up to me um, at one point, and he'd asked me if I was single. He was like, I just wanted to know if you were single because uh, I really like your shape. <laughs> Didn't specify which shape, did he? could get a hard on for hexagons, I don't fucking know. <laughs> That's weird. And it blagged my head a bit, right? Because the thing is, is I, I am naturally quite shapely. I'm naturally very curvy, right? Like, I mean, I've also had my hand in the pick and mix a couple of times and all, I'm not fucking denying it. <laughs> Doesn't bother me, not ashamed. Love a cherry cola bottle, but <laughs> just blagged my head a bit. And the thing is, is like, because even, even if I lost a load of weight, I'd still have big hips, right? I'm, I'm basically, I'm like a Yorkshire Shakira. <laughs> You know how her hips don't lie? Well, mine don't bugger about. They're there, they're not shifting, right? That's my thing. But I told my mate about this. I told, I was like, this bloke said this and it just blacked my head. And she then said this description. And I, it's honestly one of my favorite things anyone's described me as. I love it. I want it on a t-shirt. Ready? She said, the thing is though, Lou, is you do have a lovely shape. If I was to describe it, I'd say, you're like Jessica Rabbit if she went to Greg's. I was like, I'll fucking have that. <laughs> I have a problem with that. More than happy to be a steak bait, Jessica Rabbit. I have a fucking problem. Yes, please. You can have that. It's all right. <laughs> it was good. Um, it was my friend Lisa that said that. I went home, because uh, I'm from Hull originally, so I went home for the first time about a year and a half. Uh, not too long ago. Yeah, it was long, mate. Apocalypse, innit? Um, and my friend Lisa. Give you an idea about Lisa. I was reminded of this story when I went home. I love this. Um, do you remember years ago now when everybody got a copy of Jamie's 30 Minute Meals as a stocking filler for Christmas? Do you remember this? And then everybody complained that it didn't take 30 minutes. Yeah? Anyone want to shout out why they think it didn't take 30 minutes? You are? <laughs> Don't you have to shop for food anyway? <laughs> you have to go shopping for food, he should have provided it, tit. <laughs> I wanted a delivery, I'd got confused. No, like, um, the thing is, my friend Lisa, she had a, because she said this, when I asked her, I was like, why don't you think it took 30 minutes? She went, honestly, the problems with his recipe, it doesn't allow enough time for fag breaks. <laughs> So do you know how stressful it is cooking a frittata for four people? I can't do that without nicotine. You're looking at an hour, hour and a half if you chain it. I was like, right, thanks for that. Put that in the feedback form back to him, shall I? Fucking hell. 